science experiment. Last time, I showed you how electricity flows. This time, I am going to make a simple circuit board. Now, the materials we need are small light bulb, wires, switch, two double A battery, battery holder, electrical tape, screw, screwdriver, and I'm gonna be using a board, but I used a styrofoam and also a colored paper. So let's start the experiment. So now let's get the two battery and place it down the battery holder. The battery supplies the voltage and current to energize a device attached to the circuit. So now let's get the light bulb and get the battery holder and connect it to the positive side. The bulb provides the electrical load on the circuit. And the black wire to the negative side. So the connection is working. So now let's try with a switch. Let's open the switch so we can connect the wires inside of it. Switch is used to control the electrical energy that flows on the circuit. The switch opens and closes the circuit. The wire serves the path of the circuit on which the energy flows. So now let's connect them together. Connect the red wire to the long leg of the bulb. And connect the black wire to the shorter leg of the bulb. So now let's prepare our board and cover it with colored paper. La, 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 la. <laughs> so let's place it now in a board. Now let's attach the light bulb to the board. Let's attach the other things too. Here we can see that our circuit board has four parts. Source or the battery, connecting wires, electric device, and switch. So this is it. Let's test it out. The electricity flows through the connecting wires. It goes to the electric device. Then the device can now produce light or heat. So that's all for this experiment. I hope this will help you make your own circuit board. Thank you. Bye-bye.